Well, Jim, it's a real zoo here, a 160-acre, $25 million project that is formally opening tomorrow. Tonight, the zoo is being dedicated in ceremonies here in this amphitheater. The speeches have just started. As darkness falls, you can't see very much of the zoo from here, but this afternoon, these VIPs got a special preview. More than a thousand friends and supporters of the Metro Zoo got a preview late this afternoon of what the rest of South Florida will see starting tomorrow. Like the raucous Siamangs, they're a kind of gibbon. These wanted to sing along with some exotic red and white striped creatures playing music from as far away as New Orleans. From the tram, visitors can catch a glimpse of Shanti, the rhinoceros, or a pride of lions who can also be seen through a close-up viewing cage. Then there are the always popular European brown bears. And the star of the tour, Ramar, the gorilla, he started life as a nightclub performer. Well, you can see all of that and more tomorrow when the zoo opens at 10 a.m. As Ralph Rennick might say, if he were here, may the good news be yours. Reporting live from the Metro Zoo, Michael Putney, Channel 4 News. Metro Zoo officials couldn't have asked for a better day to have their grand opening for the general public. With cool temperatures and clear skies, it was a perfect day for browsing and walking. During the first hour the zoo was open, approximately 900 visitors went through the turnstiles, and officials expect 15,000 persons to visit the zoo this weekend. <laughs> The new Metro Zoo has more than 40 animal exhibits, every one of them cageless. And getting around the 160-acre zoo is no problem. Tram rides are available, as well as tours for those who want a little insight into the zoo's many residents. Red kangaroos are kind of interesting. We have a male on display here and two females. Dade Countyans waited 10 years to have their new $23 million zoo. It's already the biggest in the country. So what did they think on their first visit? We just started, but what we see, we've liked very much. Yes, very much. Yeah, very impressed. It's very good. I like the zoo very much. Anything in particular that you like? Monkeys and tigers. You saw the tiger? Mm hmm He was very big. I would meet him in a dark alley. Well, I'm from New Jersey, and uh, next time I'm down in Miami, I'd certainly come by and take a look. It's great. County planners say the new zoo will continue getting bigger and better. Well, the preview center was 35 acres, roughly the size of our old Crandon Park Zoo. And what we opened today is 160 acres, so it's not only four and five times as large, but so many additions. Our amphitheater shows, our replica of a Malayan village. Uh, the new Metro Zoo is open seven days a week from 10 in the morning until 4 in the afternoon. Admission is $3.75 for adults and $1.50 for children. Elliot Rodriguez, Channel 4 News at the new Metro Zoo.